is this? What do you got in there? Cinder blocks? Huh. <laughs> Half million in cash. <laughs> Bring that dirt, 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 dirt. Yo, you know I got that dirt. What happened now? Does he not have any legs? Why is he crawling? Wait, what? Why is it? Oh, no, a bear of them are crawling. Why? Whoa, no, a bear of them are crawling. Why? Is that, is that murk, yeah? Oh. Who's that? Wait, why are you man calling as well? In your suits as well? Like what? Now you might go out of the car to crawl. Nah, what is going on? I'm not gonna lie, I have no idea what's happening. Skeleton Heisenberg. Good afternoon. In the last several minutes, KOB has received dozens of reports of what appears to be a crashed aircraft, possibly two aircraft on Albuquerque's east side. But officials warn that with a debris field of this magnitude, the investigation officials and the cleanup are now well saying that the Boeing the 737 meantime, was being rerouted or vectored through the airspace, which is standard procedure, according to a spokesman for the FAA. Hating that the final down. death toll now stands at 167. Oh my God, 167 people died? 167. It was indeed a lone air traffic controller's fateful mistake. El nombre del hombre es Donald Margolas. A one fateful mistake that killed 167 people. Oh, man. Margolis, oh, no. Of the FAA's air route oh, no. Center. And he's probably Albert lost his job Margolis as well. recently returned to work after a five week absence. His troubled daughter, Jane Margolis, age 26, apparently had a long history of substance abuse. Oh, my Friends God. I get these whole. Whole story out like the whole oh child, my god. Margolis particularly hard. Of course. Coming as it did little more than a month before, many are questioning the timing of his return to work. Yeah. And are wondering how much blame truly lies with those who let this grieving father. What are you doing? Oh, okay. Why? Why? That's hundreds. Yeah, what are you doing? Where would you like to begin? Um, I really just need this. Quick and easy, you know, as uh, quick as something like this can be. What's she doing? Okay. Is that mutual? Does your husband go along with that? Has he moved out? Uh, no. Uh, we're in the process of moving him out. Yeah, today, hopefully. And um, in the meantime, my, my son and um, my daughter and I are staying with my sister. Oh, God. You weren't one of the... Right? Mm. Yeah, right beneath the flight path. And Yeah. We had debris land in our yard and all over our neighborhood. Mm, so terrible. Yeah, so awful. I know. Um, 
Anyway, I was certainly not ready to move back, but it's time. And um, I'm sure we're driving my sister and her husband up a wall. Well, you definitely want to maintain residency in your actual home. What about other debts or assets? Do you feel you have a good understanding of you and your husband's financial situation? No, you have no idea. Cause remember, she found out that she found out that um, he paid for the for his chemo and stuff like that. So is your husband employed? You know what? Here's the thing. I I'm really not looking for any sort of uh, loopholes or um, I don't know. Just no. No, I think she just needs to understand what's the financial I stuff. Intend that every one of my clients get a full and honest accounting of what it is they owe and what it is they, they own. own. Mm. I hope he hit them. I don't know why you would ever, I, I don't know why you would even try to burn the peas. From the bear, in it, yeah. Hey, Walt. Hey. hey, buddy, there you are. Listen, I, uh, you know, well, it's, uh, it's tough. To get your stuff in it. I mean, I speak with some authority because we definitely had some shitty weeks in the past few months, you know. I feel like none of them was probably call, worse. You know, call freaking the I feel like, Guinness Book of I don't know how many people died in 9-11, but I feel like a lot of people died in 9-11. Than 167 people. I am, I know. Look, look. But this situation between you and, uh, uh, you know, I don't know. You beat a little tactical retreat, yeah? You regroup, and then, boom. You know, absence makes the... The, 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 the heart goes stronger, so I know that, right? Or the heart goes fonder, wherever it is. Jesus. We got in there, cinder blocks. Ha! <laughs> Half million in cash. <laughs> he ain't gonna believe that. That's the spirit. He's flowering out, bitch. Shaved? He looking kind of clean. Okay, this rehab team doing kind of nice. Oh, he does not look Come good. On, give me a show of hands. You should be here to learn self acceptance. Oh. Okay. <coughs> hey, honey, you, uh, you want another waffle? Uh, hey, hello, everybody. Good morning. I was just checking in and thought I'd uh, pass along the current contact information. I mean, you certainly can always reach me on my cell. I've always got that on me. But uh, in terms of uh, a, a mailing address. Hey, Dad, it's me. Oh, he picked up. Bless no, him. No, I'm, I'm not okay. I, I don't know what the hell's going on. Nobody's telling me jack shit around hey. here. Tell him. Why have they not told... Wait, so wait, okay. So you've kicked out, you've kicked out Walt. And you haven't told your son what's going on. I'm not gonna lie. That's a bit of a... Because it's like he's a child. And, I mean, I know he's a child, but he's a... Big man, you know, you know what I mean? <laughs> I feel like I at least know what's, what the situation is. I, I don't even care anymore. Can, can you just give me a ride to school? I'll take you to school. Yeah, no. I, I'm ready now. Flynn, I'm taking you to school. <laughs> no authority, boy. Jesus. I wonder if Holly's going to do the same thing when she grows up. What are you looking at? Or it's... What's his name? I just find it, you know, really, really hard to concentrate. Why? Because of the plane because crash. All the horrors, you know, we perceived. This is an awful idea. I'm no not even going to lie. Guys. Just feelings. You can say anything and everything that's on your mind. Anyone? Oh my God, don't tell me what June's going to come down. Just keep asking myself, why did this happen? Because... I mean, if there's a God and all, why does he allow all those innocent people to die for no reason? Okay, can we just... <laughs> <laughs> no, no, you said no judgment. Let the girl speak. You know what I'm saying? You said free sleeping much. freedom of speech and that. Else have a Is it not like America's like, um, you know, 
go to motto like freedom of speech. Da, 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 da. I really don't think you don't have freedom of speech. So I can't even lie. I feel like that's probably one of the biggest lies I've ever heard. But I mean, I didn't say that. I just don't. From what I've seen and from what I've heard on the news and stuff like that, I, I, I think freedom of speech in America is just not, it's just really not a thing. Because technically you can go jail for freedom of speech. I won't give an example, but you really can. You just keep hearing that, that sound. Oh, the helicopter's crashing. That boom. It just plays over and over in my head like it won't ever stop. Damn, that's actually kind of dark. I can't lie. Is there anyone else? I bet Walt. Do you, I bet. Oh, okay. I bet. I was gonna say. I bet Walt stands up and talks. Right okay. next to his sea dudes, because like he has sea dudes, but. Okay. There was still a pair of legs buckled into them. Oh damn. <laughs> Mo what of the human Maybe legs? From the faculty. What's the name? It starts with a C, right? Or Carmen or something, I can't remember. Uh, I, I guess what I, I would sorry. Sorry. First of all, nobody on the ground was killed. And that Oh, right, was they not? An incident like this over a, a populated urban center. That right there, that's, that's... Oh, so what, 167 people on the plane died? Oh, I, like, I thought it, like, when they said 107 people died, I honestly thought there was, like, two passengers, like, two pilots in probably, like, each plane, and then, you know, they fell on people. That's what I thought, but if no one on a... Okay, that's not... Okay. Gotta be some minor miracle. And bro was comparing this to 9-11. What? You've lost your mind. Plus, neither plane was full. What you're left with... Casualty wise is just the fiftieth worst air disaster. Actually, <laughs> tied for fiftieth. There are What Bo's control. really saying is it's not that deep. Move on. <laughs> Base that's basically what he's saying. I'm not gonna lie, yeah, fiftieth, so it's not even like thirty. You know what I'm saying? It's not that deep, guys. Just move on. Like it's fine. I mean, no matter, it's fine. <laughs> Love 53 him. Crashes throughout history. That are just as bad or worse. <laughs> Tenerife? It's, I mean, it's way bigger than a 737. And we're talking about two of them. Oh, bro, it's really out here looking on the bright side. Died. So, oh, and damn, that's actually quite a lot. Damn. But did any of you even remember it at all? Any of you? I doubt it. <laughs> you know why? Because people move on. Bro, really is saying, listen, only 187 people died. You might not even remember when 600 people died. Move on, man. And it's not that deep. Let's just, let's go over this. You ain't, you ain't getting no A's. I don't care about your friend's legs. I mean, the brother's legs. Move on. I love it. Lo move on. <laughs> and we will too. We will move on and we will get past this. Because that is what human beings do. We survive. And uh, we survive. We yeah, bro. Yeah, she really said, um, okay. can I have the mic, please? Car. You ain't spinning. But let him cook, though. Let him cook. One ute with a goat. They're not going to start crawling on the floor again, are they? They're not going to take the child, are they? I'm never going to take the goat. What, they're taking clothes? Ah, oh, yeah, they got guns. They're, they're strapped up as well. My girl looked at her husband like, are you going to do something? No! No, I'm not going to do nothing. There's two guys. Look at that, mess me up. What am I gonna do something for? Listen, one, they're not, they're not hurting any of your, your, your child or your wife or you. All they're doing is taking clothes that at some point in your time you can go and get back. You know what I'm saying? Just materialistic stuff. It's not that deep, you know?
I don't know if there's any women that watch my stuff. I mean, I know there's a few, but would you leave your man for not doing nothing in this situation? Or would you not, not maybe leave, maybe leaving is a bit, is a bit far-fetched, but would you be disappointed or would you leave a, would you lose a bit of respect for your man for not, I guess, protecting the family? I, I guess it's not, I guess there's not really much to protect because they're not attacking him or threatening him, but technically like your, your items are being robbed. So in that sort of sense, would you? So I, I'm just curious about like, because personally, I'm not putting myself in danger of people with guns. Like even if I didn't know they had a, like, do you know what I'm saying? There's two guys, it's just me. My daughter's there, my wife's there, my goat's there. Like I'm, I'm, I'm not getting, like, I'll, like, well, you don't want my jeans? Cool, take them. You don't want my shirt? Take it. You want my jeans jacket? Take it. I can always get a new one. It's not that deep. Or maybe I'll just cough on them and then, you know, run away. Oh, no, I don't, I, 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 see now it's different. Why are you approaching the you? Oh, they left in the car. Hey. Hey, how's your Aunt Marie doing? Fine. I, I guess. Oh. You make sure you say hello to her for me, will you? Why don't you just come inside? It's your house. Boom! If I'm the one that paid for the yard, I'm not being kicked out of my house. And I'm just telling you that straight. And you can be like, well, obviously I know that I know the, 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 the mother needs, the child needs the mother and stuff, but I'm just telling you this now. I am not moving out of my house that I paid for because you want to get a divorce or because you want to break up or because, you know what I'm saying? That's just not happening. He's gone. How are you? Why, why, why you got to treat him like this? Uh, tell him. Why, why you got to be like this? Why can't you just talk hey, even? Hey, hey. No, 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 no. Let him get this off of his chest. You ain't even told him what's going on. Oh, Ron Flynn. You know, try not to hold it against him. You know, I mean, the poor kid, he's probably just dying of curiosity. It's that sneaky rat bastard 24-7 voice. You guys know what I'm talking about, that voice that tells you you're not good enough? Oh, no, I don't. I don't. Enough for what? Not good enough to I don't get that in my head. Be what? President of the... I mean, I actually do have very good conversation with myself. I'm not even going to lie to you. I don't know if that's weird or not. Like, do you not ever just, like, talk to yourself on a regular basis? Like, I know I'm technically doing it now, but you don't see this. But I mean, I like, when I say if I'm not recording, I will actually just casually have a conversation with myself. Do you guys do that as well? Or is that just... Weird. I don't know. United States, well... Okay, so maybe you're not that good. Jesse... We never hear from you. What's going on? Um. You tell me I'm full of shit. It's okay. I don't mind. Nah, Just, he ain't even that type of person. On. Let us in on it. What makes you the experts? I don't think I ever said I was that. Nah, but. You're the one sitting here, right? Mmm. Um, and so. Be happy. Forgive yourself. Blah, blah, blah. What makes you? Have you ever really hurt anybody? I mean, Jesse, have you really hurt someone? Because I, I, from what I've seen so far, above, like I said, disappointing your parents, which obviously, yeah, but you haven't really hurt anyone either. I'm not even going to lie. You didn't do nothing to the girl. You didn't do nothing to, you, you wasn't the reason for the guy's head being smashed. I guess you might have been the reason for your friend getting shot because you told him to stand there by himself in new territory. I mean, I guess you could kind of say that, but. I killed my daughter. Oh! Whoa! I did the not see that coming. July 18th, which is my birthday. I was high on cocaine and oh, I was drunk. Oh God, okay. Cocaine wasn't an issue because I had bought myself two grams the night before as a birthday present. I had plenty left. But I was out of vodka, so I'm arguing with my wife. Okay. Come on, go to the ABC for me. 
It's my birthday. Come on. You're not gonna sell it to me. She's my six-year-old daughter. She's playing at the end of the driveway. No way. So. You run her over? I did hate myself. Bro ran over his six-year-old daughter just to go and get more vodka. Maybe you are the expert and I can't even lie. Yeah, I fucking imagine. Didn't stop me from drinking and getting high. You don't hate yourself that much then. It could only be Skylar, Walt Jr., Marie, Hank. And that's pretty much it. I don't know who else knows where he lives. But what should not be... Oh, and it's Skylar! Is this a good time to talk? Uh, anytime's a good time to get the fuck in. Yeah, we come in. We Please. Come. What did you come to say? Or did you come here to, for him to explain himself? Filing for divorce. Why, why are you doing this? We are happily married. What? I am happily married. I am happy. We're just... I love you, Skylar. And I would do anything for you. Do you know what I'm thinking? And you don't mind not agree with this one but if you found out your husband had two phones found out he paid for his thing himself and kind of that he was hiding money from you would you get a divorce like i get you being pissed but is that worth a divorce i don't because he's because th obviously at first you thought he was cheating right and then you kind of come to the expectation of, because of she thought he, he was doing something with the woman, that, the rich woman that he was like dating before. But obviously it turns out not to be true because she called her and obviously said the truth and he'd given her money. So obviously she knew that she's hiding money. But if bro was hiding money, is that enough to be divorced? Like, would you, is that enough for you to file, to divorce, file for divorce? You know what I'm saying? You come in here and you wave these papers in my face mm. when there's a, a whole other entire side to this thing. There's your side and there's my side and you haven't heard my side yet. True. You haven't heard any of it at all. True. Uh... Oh. Wait a goddamn picking minute. You're trying to tell me she went back to go and help my man do the fraud company stuff, but you know Walt's a drug dealer and you're filing for divorce. So you'll do fraud with your boss, but you won't let your husband drug dealers slide how does that make sense i know you're gonna be like yeah but drugs are no, no. so is fraud you still get locked up for fraud i'm not gonna lie you might get even more do you get more years for fraud than, than selling drugs probably do you i don't know do you i don't know but i don't know i'm not gonna lie to you that's that's messed up no what how <laughs> He didn't, he didn't play it off well, I can't lie. Did she just guess that? Marijuana. That Pinkman kid. Oh, she thinks she said a marijuana? Nah, darling. He's selling a whole different schmack. No. Oh, damn. Oh! No, he's not even. What's he doing? Crystal, right? Is that. Methamphetamine. 
I won't tell Hank, and I won't tell your children, or anybody else. Nobody will hear it from me, but only if you grant me this divorce and stay. <coughs> I mean it. I know you're not gonna be like, Don, how are you gonna compare fraud to like selling crystal? I mean, a crime's a crime, right? Like, they're both doing something that's, you know, a crime in a sense. And like he said, he's not like he's a drug dealer on the road. He's just a manufacturer. So technically, as much as I guess coke or crack is hurting people. Uh, yeah, I guess as much as crack is hurting people, he don't care. He don't see them people hurt. But the same way fraud is still affecting other people some way or some shape or form. He's still taking money out of your company or wherever, whatever he's doing to do it. Like, I'm not going to lie. But either way, that's still hypocritical because technically they're both crimes. But you chose to go help an ex man other than your husband. I'm not gonna lie, that's disgusting. Wow, he's free, yeah? yeah. He's like, what happened to your car? Your windshield's broken. <laughs> he knows. A little friction in the marriage right now. Little, you're going for Checking divorce. We're just going through divorce. A break. Uh, that's you over there. You're better. Really? Yeah, he's. What's the rehab? Does it help? Yeah. I'm done using. Good. Thank you, Jesse. I don't want to see you on that again. That's excellent. On this airplane crash, it landed in his house. You know, it was Jane's dad who accidentally crashed them together. Jane's, that's his name. He was so torn up. You are not responsible for this. Not, not at all. In any way, shape, or form. Not at all. All right. Now, I, I am very <coughs> up to date on this thing. Probably far more than you are. And there are there are many factors at play there. You either run from things. Or you face them, Mr. White. Oh. What exactly does that mean? I learned it in rehab. It's all about accepting who you really are. And who are you? The fuck I'm up. That guy. You're not even that bad. You're not even that bad of a person, though. That's the thing. He's really not even that bad of a person. Is the food to your satisfaction? Very much. It's good to see you again. Okay. Um, may I? I'm here because I owe you the courtesy and respect to tell you this personally. Well, don't tell me you step out of the game. I'm done. Oh my God. How many times have we go through this last season? Like, it has nothing to do with you personally. <coughs> extraordinarily professional and I appreciate the way you do business I am not a criminal no offense to any people <laughs> that's a backtrack real quick this is not me three million dollars for three months of your time whoa three months then out Whoa, free mill? I have money. I have more money than I know how to spend. What I don't have is my family. Hmm. The answer is still no. Fair play, fair play. I hear you. Thank you. Fair enough. He took that quite well. I thought it would be like, not mad, but like, you know what I'm saying? Oh. Yeah. 
What, are you gonna stop talking now? Yeah, yeah, bro is like, yeah, no, I, I ain't gonna say to you. I mean, just... Wait, what? Oh, I, I'm not gonna lie. Why did they kill all of them? Oh, we should have like, yeah, I was gonna say, I don't think he died if you only shot him in the leg. Who are these guys? I don't understand. His head dropped before the gun sound went off. <laughs> what? Bro said, yeah, I got something lined up, you know. Bro went, nah, no, you don't. Wow. And he's going to throw out the gasoline and then... That's a bit close. I was going to say, that's a bit close though, no? Ain't it going to... Yeah, they're all dead. Damn! Okay. Wow. That was a great episode. I can't even lie. That was an actual great episode. <coughs> that was a really good episode. Um. Oh, three million for three months. He turned it down. I guess he does have more money than he to do with. But is that what six hundred k going to be enough to? Have your daughter look after your daughter for the rest of her life or until she's like 18, 21. You know, I don't know. It's a question. But anyway, if you guys enjoyed the video, leave a like, try to become a done today. And I'll catch you done in a bit. Peace.